Welcome to the Leaderings. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Dolly Dreams. And today we're going to be showing you how to make this cute hairstyle. So it has two plaits coming down here, and it makes it look like it has one plait just going across, but it's actually two, and then it has this plait going down the middle. Yeah, it's actually really simple to make. It just looks so cool. Yeah, it's one we made up all by ourselves. Someone else might have done this before, but we haven't seen it, so we're just going to say we made it up. <laughs> yes, and we've even done it on Felicia. It was very tricky doing it on a mini doll, but we managed to do it. So if you're going to plan to do it on a mini doll, then you might need to have either tiny fingers, a steady hand, or just a lot of time. <laughs> And today we're going to be showing you how to do it on mine and Alice's so hair. Step one is to take any existing hairstyles out of your doll's hair and then brush your doll's so, hair. So we're just going to brush Alice's hair right now, and we are going to be using a spray bottle, a little bit like that. So it's just useful if you just do one or two sprays. Depends how big the sprays are in your spray bottle, and just to dampen your doll's hair to make it easier so it's not so fly away and it just makes it easier to brush too and this is helpful in um, later stages especially when you want the hairstyle to fit a little bit more so you just want to brush it and make it so there's no knots step number two is to do the plaits that you will need to do to have that plait so, rim. The plait needs to be, if you just got a little bit of hair from the front, um, yeah, just about that big. I'm not entirely sure if you can see how much that is. But if you just get that much, and then you just literally got to plait that. So, obviously, if your doll has longer hair, such as Sophie, then it will be a long plait, but if it has shorter hair, such as Ella, then it will be shorter, obviously. So, then, it would, I would recommend either getting a band or using a clip or a pin or something like that, so the plait doesn't unravel. It doesn't need to be too tight, just something that unravels it. And then, you need to do the same on the other side. Okay, it should look a little bit like this. Now, you've got these two plaits here, which you will then bring back around and embed in the plait. So, what you want to do is now turn your doll around. That's best to do turn around. So, we're just going to turn so this is Ella around. Ella from the back. You can't really see Felicia behind this hair, but she's there. <laughs> so, then you can um, split the hair into three. If your doll has shorter hair, this will be a little bit tricky, but it should you should be able to manage. So, now, once you split it into three, you get the two outer edges and put them just in front of our the doll's shoulders or just out of the way. So, the, it's this middle bit you'll need to worry about for and this you bit. Need to split and then you split the middle section into half. And then you take both of the plaits and you put it in between these two, the two bits of the middle section and then you take both of the bands out or the pins or something that you've used to hold the plaits in place you take them out and then you kind of have got to put these inside the two parts of the um inside plait i'm hoping this makes sense <laughs> so yes and you've just kind of, kind of twist it around and then that's what you're going to be plaiting with this middle bit. And then you literally just take the rest of the um hair and just plait it as if you usually would plait your doll's hair. Now a band. I guess you could clip it if you wanted to, but it's probably easiest to do a band. And then, and then that is the hairstyle done. Yes. 
so that is what you need to do. And that is what the hairstyle looks like from the front. So, we're just going to go over it again in Safi's head, just as a recap. <laughs> you can add some water using a spray bottle if you wish. So, we've just done both of the plaits. We haven't um, tied them up with anything because it's so small. <laughs> So now you need to turn it all around and split the hair into three, just as if you're doing a plait. Remember, for the moment, you don't need the two side ones. You just need the middle one. You need to split that one into half. And then you need to take the two plaits and put them directly in the middle of those two halves. Just like this. And then you need to put the two halves back together and plait as if you're normally plaiting a plait. And then tie it off at the end using a hairband. And there you have it. A beautiful plait. Anyway, we hope that made sense. Yeah, well, I love the look of it. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> and we hope you enjoyed this video. We certainly enjoyed making it. Yeah, I know, right? Please could you like and subscribe, we'll be really grateful if you did. Yeah, and maybe watch another one of our videos, as it really helps out our channel. Anyway, bye! Thanks for watching Jolly Dreams. We'll see you all next time. Bye!